back. Hurricane season is upon us, and regardless of your budget, our weather team's looking out for you. Yeah, meteorologist Brittany Begley is here with just a few things to have in your emergency kit, and it doesn't have to cost you because Brittany has the dollar store versus grocery store comparisons. That is the truth, and I'm here to challenge some of your limiting beliefs about money as well. Okay. So let's start off with water. Everyone needs a gallon of water per person, so we have HEB and the Dollar Tree. But here's the deal. Dollar Tree was $1.25, but HEB was $1.22. So I actually mm -hmm. thought it was going to be the Dollar Tree, but it ended up being HEB. Is that, that surprising? That, that is surprising actually that? surprising. Yeah. I love that. Okay, so let's talk about non-perishable foods. Okay. What's your favorite thing to eat stuck in hurricanes? Well, mm. <laughs> definitely not non-perishable. <laughs> what are you going to do? You got to do what you got to do, right? Yeah, Open yeah, up a can of tuna or right, exactly. That is so true. I'll try to sass it up for you. But really, <laughs> let's talk about tuna because I was like, do you really want to eat tuna when it's hot and there's a power outage? But if you're into nutrition and you want that protein, yeah. take a look at your screen. It's going to be all about that uh, store brand HEB bag of tuna, 16 grams of tuna, and it costs you $1.08. Now, if you're like, I like name brand Chicken FC, you can get that at the Dollar Tree for $1.25. So if you want name brand on a budget, Dollar Tree is the best option. But if you're really looking to save money and maybe look at those health options, you want to go with store brand from HEB. Yeah, HEB yeah. sounds good. Sounds All really right. good. So here's something else that some people... Eating out of a can Eating or a bag can. gets old real fast, right? <laughs> it does get real fast. So you got to have that protein to help pack your patients with you and the family as you wait for electricity. And the kids. Oh, yeah. Yes. Okay, so here's one thing that a lot of people were kind of annoyed with. It is all about paper plates. For me, my mom said, you get what you get and you don't throw a fit. But some people are really particular about paper plates. So, you don't want them to fall or break, right? Yes, I mean, it is so true. I say stack them up, but you know, we got to do what we got to do. So paper plates, bottom line is the Dollar Tree is the best bet. You're going to get these for $1.25. Now you can go to HEB if you're like, no, I like my quality paper plates. I do not want them to fold. Uh, you could do that. It's going to be about eight cents uh, a plate. So that costs you three eighty four. dollars However, if you look for those in-store coupons, you'll actually save a little more. And the more you buy, right, because you need to stock yep. up on all these items. Say, the more a lot you of this buy, you can have throughout the year better. anyway, right? So yeah. this is stuff, and if you don't use it in the hurricane season, what we always used to say, throw a hurricane party, right? If, <laughs> if we didn't get a storm, you right. eat all the stuff you got through. Yep. The, that is the anyway. truth, and you work out later. Okay, so then I asked each store, I said, all right, tell me, what is the favorite item that you have? What do people actually line up? Right now, get, during right hurricane now. season, yeah. Yes, can you guess what it is, Dollar Tree? It is okay if you get it wrong. I just want to go toilet paper. Okay, we're close. <laughs> it was the body wipes. So, okay. yes, for $1.25. And these are name brand body wipes. They smell okay. good. They work great. Uh, toilet paper also works great, too, <laughs> depending on your, how thick you like yes. toilet paper. Right. We had that well, discussion. Well, we did have that discussion. Yeah, yeah. The HEB toilet paper. It is pretty good, right? Yeah. You know what? Toilet paper, paper plates. I think we got a trend going on here. <laughs> and then for HEB, on a serious note, I was like, all right, what is it for you? And they say it's the coolers because coolers are really really expensive, especially if you're watching every penny in your mm -hmm. bank account. But yeah. they say, if you need a cooler, you need to buy it on the holidays because that's the time that coolers go on sale. So mm. if you get it during the holidays, you're ready for hurricane season. Yeah. Now, the Dollar Tree did have smaller coolers, but overall, I was like, yes, I will buy my cooler during the holidays when I can save a little money. Yeah, you can get sure. you can get a bunch just in case your power goes out. Yes. You can have, you know, your food kind of safe I mean, for honestly, a little while. Honestly, you should really have all year long. I mean, I know some yep. of it, we, we, we think about hurricanes season which is important I'm not good about know. the water until hurricane season until it hits, now right? I'm now I'm yep. getting gallons and gallons every week when I go to the store mm -hmm. just to have enough mm -hmm. I mean you can work out you can make sure your arms look great if you need to save money at the gym you're gonna hydrate and you'll be doing good <laughs> all the things we don't need dumbbells all the things and saving money <laughs> you don't need kettlebells <laughs> and speaking of saving tomorrow what we're gonna talk about tomorrow is just some of those apps for those higher price items uh, that actually give you coupons okay so like those fancier items that you might like you think these things never go on sale. That is not true. I found the perfect app for you. Plus, you can buy coupons online. So I will break it all down for you. I believe safety should be on every budget. And that yeah. is, you know, the goal of us and our team yeah. is to make sure everybody is prepared. Yeah, yes, it advice. is. Oh, Brittany, thank you so yeah, much. We'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>